Hi, I'm Angela from Stamp with Angela and today I'm going to share with you the Garden Golden Designer Specialty Acetate. So when you pack, you get three sheets of this specialty acetate. Um, this is the first design here. So it's an, a cool pattern. And then we've got these two here. I'll show you one at a time and they actually coordinate with some of the designer series paper. So I'll show you how that works. So you can see here it's gold on one side and actually silver on the other. And you do need to, it's got a piece at the back that you need to peel off as well once you use it. So that's just there to protect it. So I wanna give you a couple of tips today on how you can adhere it and also how it coordinates with the papers. So this design here can be just used Cut it up to strips or pieces to put on your designer series paper and use it as you wish or even die cut it. The um, Fine Art Floral Suite has this designer series part which is part of it. It is the um, Fine Art Floral Designer Series paper so it's got that sort of painted look on it. Lots and lots of beautiful flowers so that's the, oops you can't see the last one. They're the different designs and then if you so they're all very flowery turn it over and you'll see lots of more um, just patterns and colors and things so I'll put that so you can see all the different patterns so these two patterns here coordinate with this paper so if you have a look at this and you put it over the top it gives that gold edge around all the flowers. So I'll just show you that for a moment, then I'll take it off again so you can see. So that's it normally, which is beautiful. Lay this on the top and line it up. And then you've got that nice gold edging as well. And this paper here also coordinates. So trying to get it the right way is the um, key. So if you have a look in that top left corner you've got kind of a um, stem and leaf like that. The stem and leaf so line it up and there you go that gold edges lots of the things and then there's also just some gold patterns in between. So it's just those two sheets that coordinate with those patterns. So now you're thinking okay acetate it's clear how do I adhere it without showing the glue? So maybe you've cut a piece down that you're using as a card. I'm not going to be cutting this up because it's part of a paper share. But what I would do is I would get my multi-purpose liquid glue, my Tombow, and I would put dots of glue where the gold or on the side, the silver pattern is, and very, very lightly so it doesn't squirt out, and then just gently line it up and stick it down so that you're just putting it, it's being hidden by the pattern basically. Or if you happen to have a sentiment or something, then obviously you could put some tape or, or um, dimensionals or something underneath and then your cardstock with your sentiment um, stamped on it would then hide it as well. So you can adhere other things on top and hide the glue or tape underneath or um, just put very little dots of glue with your uh, liquid glue. So I hope you find that useful. So remember there are three different patterns of that gold one. These two you could use on your own or coordinate. And then we've also got the other pattern as well. So thanks for watching and I hope you found that useful. Uh, please feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Leave a comment and like. Thanks so much. Bye.